Girl, it's me. 30 days ago, I met a man on Match.com and we're getting married. Let's get it. So, yes, let's talk about it. So, this lovely lady behind me is the lady that's going viral. She's the one that met the gentleman on Match.com and they're getting married in 30 days, within 30 days. Now, everyone has their opinion on th this situation. Um, me personally, I feel like if they're two consenting adults and they feel like that they've found their forever person, I send positive energy towards them and congratulations on finding love. Now, the astrologer in me is a little bit curious as to how this happened. So again, my name is Sonia. I'm with Melanin Goddess Life. I'm a practicing astrologer along with a manifestation coach. And I like to look at things from an astrological standpoint. So I've been looking at her content on her page, just trying to get to know her. And I stumbled across some things about her that stood out to me. Now, I found out that she is an Aries son, which spoke a lot to how she approached this whole situation. If you know anything about Aries energy, it's the first sign of the Zodiac. And Aries people are very headstrong. Once they get something in their head, they're going to dive head first into it. Sometimes they don't really... Uh, kind of look at the landscape of things. If they're passionate about something, if they believe in something, they're going to jump all the way in. And this is no different. She has jumped all the way into this. Now, as I was going through her content, I did find out what her birthday was. So um, I did a little astrological research and I found out that there may be some validity to this whole thing. Now, she is a airy sun. And if my astrological calculations are correct, she's also a Libra rising. And if you know anything about the sign of Libra, that's the sign of partnership. So these are people that do really well with partners, partnering with other people. That could be in business, that could be in their personal life, but they really, really do well with partnerships. And it is the sign of marriage. So she is from her, looking at her content, very much a lover girl, a hopeless romantic, and she believes in love. Nothing wrong with that at all. But the thing that stood out for me is her Jupiter. Again, if my astrological calculations are correct, her Jupiter, her natal Jupiter is in the sign of Taurus. So with that being said, currently transiting Jupiter is in the sign of Taurus. So what happens with that from an astrological standpoint is if your natal Jupiter and the transiting Jupiter are in the same sign, this is going to trigger a Jupiter return, which happens every 12 years. One of the things that can happen when this, when this uh, return comes around is we find love. So the timing of this is actually on par for her finding someone, maybe her forever person. So from an astrological standpoint, I do believe she may have found her person. Now, it may be crazy to other people how they met and how they're, you know, going into this relationship just head first. And people think that who does that? With the state of marriages the way they are now and the marriage rate, the divorce rate at 50% here in the United States, it seems like the traditional way of doing relationships isn't working either. So again, from an astrological standpoint, she may be actually on par to meet someone. And one other thing, that's, one other thing that supports her is also she's an Aries sun and currently uh, the North Node of Destiny. This is the node that represents, you know, our destiny, our future, where we're trying to go, is currently in her sun sign, which means new beginnings and transformations for this lovely lady. So hopefully she sees this video if she's interested in meeting with me and getting a little bit deeper into her astrology chart. I would love to, to do that. If not, I wish her all the best. Have fun with this. And um, I look for some updates and I can't wait for the wedding pictures. Bye-bye.